next guest is a woman you know from Your Honor, Gossip Girl, The Night Of. Now she plays an alcoholic who moved back in with mom in the new comedy, Single Drunk Female. Watch it Thursday nights on Freeform and on Hulu the next day. Please welcome Sophia Black D'Elia. <laughs> I'm good. I heard um, last time you were here was was quite some time ago. It was a while ago, yeah. Uh, just to recap, mm -hmm. your dad is a judge in New Jersey. That's right. And then I learned that. Well, explain what happened because um, so yeah. so we talked a lot about my dad, right? Which he loved. Okay. Um, very much. Good. And he was really touched, and I think kind of thought maybe you guys would become friends just oh, because okay. we talked about him. So he sent you a box of cigars. Right. With a, with a thank you note for being so kind to me and which you were. Uh, um, I know, it's, really, it's nice. really sweet. Jimmy did not respond. Yeah. <laughs> My dad is very offended. Well, I first of all, don't blame him. Mm -hmm. Secondly, never got the cigars. I believe you, I believe you. Thirdly, where are my cigars, Guillermo? How did... <laughs> oh, my God. I gave it to your assistant. You... <laughs> <laughs> Someone got some nice cigars. I will say I'm very meticulous. Uh, some might say neurotic about thank you notes, so mm -hmm. I absolutely would have sent him one. I'm sure. I'm and sure. I've actually written him a note for you to bring uh, home to him, so... He's going to love that Okay, so good, much. because I feel bad. I mean... But he now might actually expect that you will be friends. So well, maybe... maybe we will be friends. Okay, I don't know. You know, maybe I'll be a defendant in his court. <laughs> yeah. So you got married since the last time I saw you. I did. I got married in October. You got married in October. Congratulations. Thank you. And we have a photograph here of you and your husband and your dad That's officiating. My dad. Mm -hmm. um, now, is that legal for a father to, because like when they say who uh, gives this bride away or whatever, right. he'd be like, oh, I mean, it's me in this case, right? Right. right. Yeah, it was pretty weird. He, he did a great job. Um, we found out afterwards that we actually are not, we didn't do it right. We're not legally married, so. Your dad didn't do it right? He did it right. My oh. husband and I, well, my partner and I did. <laughs> <laughs> we didn't do it right. We got like the wrong certificate or something. It, we, we messed it all up. And so I've been telling, we, we like tell people we got married, but I guess technically we're not married. Now are you gonna go take care of that? We should. You should, yeah. yeah. <laughs> You definitely well, at should. this point, you might want to just kind of wait and see, right? I mean, like, what are the repercussions for that? Like, there, uh, well, there's a tax repercussions. You may have broken a law, actually, if you filed jointly. Huh. <laughs> <laughs> okay, great. <laughs> okay, good. Well, it's a good yeah. thing my dad's a judge. I guess. <laughs> well, yeah. Although it sounds like he's not too clear on the rules either. Oh boy, yeah. What if we've like wrapped him up? And is this a crime? Oh yeah, you guys are gonna be in the cell along with the Trumps. <laughs> okay, great. <laughs> that would be very How was bad. the wedding itself? The whatever you want to call it, the, the party. Yeah, the ceremony. Yeah. Yeah, it was great. It was really small and beautiful. Um, I was very late, but everything else. Were you was really? Great. I was really late. There was an, there was kind of like a crazy accident in the Holland Tunnel, and um, I was. I think over an hour late. So you were driving separately. Yep. And you're uh, the guy yeah, the in guy the tuxedo. the guy that I was supposed to marry. Yeah. Mm-hmm. <laughs> he stood there nervously, maybe. Yeah, I think a lot of people were like, she's in traffic, and it was funny. And then I, but I think quietly he was actually quite scared. <laughs> <you know? laughs> Did he have any reason to be nervous? Were you reluctant no, at all? No, we've been together for seven years. Uh -huh. um, I was super stoked to do this, despite the fact that we didn't actually do it. And, and I, <laughs> yeah, I was really excited. Um, but everyone else, no one else hit traffic. So I guess it did seem a little suspicious that suddenly I hit traffic. What is your um, husband, or what, again, what's his name? Sorry. <laughs> Henry. Henry. What yeah. is Henry's nationality? Oh. I mean, we're Jewish. Is that a nationality? Uh, no, that's a yeah. religion. Well, it's that's kind of both. It's kind of both yeah. of those things. He's, okay, so yeah. he's used to your family, the Jewish oh, Italian. Oh, he's not Italian, if that's what you're asking. Oh, he's not Italian. Yeah, he's very much not Italian. How is he acclimating to family dinners? He's much better now. Oh. He's gotten louder, so we can actually hear Good. him. Good. 
I didn't really realize how loud we were and how like many conversations happen at once at my house until he came and I was like, did you have fun tonight? He's like, I literally have no idea what anybody said. <laughs> <laughs> um, not a clue. Um, and so he would be very quiet for the first few dinners, but now he just kind of screams insults at people and he fits right in. Good, good. Uh, have you ever had problems bringing uh, boyfriends back to the family? I, it wasn't a problem for me. I think maybe for them it wasn't very fun. I see, yeah. yeah um, right. My family is, you know, like some of my cousins would try to kind of like play into the stereotype a little bit and like pat some people down and make them feel really uncomfortable. I see, I got you. You know, yeah. I have some cousins that are like actually scary. Uh -huh. They're not playing into the stereotype. They're right. just scary. <laughs> um, but Who's Henry, your scariest cousin? My cousin Vinny. <laughs> <laughs> now, yeah. I'm not kidding. Yeah, no, I mean, kidding. you have to have a cousin Vinny, right? I have right? four cousin Vinnies. Little Vinny, Big Vinny, and then the other two are just both You Vinny. have four cousin Vinnies? Yeah. That's a lot of them. I know, but only one is scary. Okay, all right. Well, we'll let him figure out which one he is, right? <laughs> he knows. He knows. <laughs> yeah. uh, are they you know, all watching you on this show play a single drunk female? I think so, yeah. And are your parents bursting with pride that their daughter is the single drunk female? I think so, yeah. Do they give you reports on uh, what they think of the show? They do. My mom is really thoughtful and sweet and, and loves the show. You know, it's like a very sweet show about recovery and she's very moved by it. And my dad's comments are always like about my facial expressions, which I find really weird. It's like he doesn't listen to the show. He just sees it or something. But like <laughs> that, I, it's for some reason, like that to him is like the mark of a good actor when like you make good facial expressions. <laughs> so yeah, he like calls me after each episode and he's like, that one look you gave that one person was amazing. And I'm like, <laughs> But did you watch, like, but do you like the story? Like, what about the characters? Like, doesn't care. Yeah. Yeah. Well, maybe he's gotten used to not listening to anything going on at dinner, and <laughs> he's just looking attention. at faces now. Yeah. <laughs> yeah. Well, please, again, apologize I to will. him. I did, I didn't, I don't, and also, I have a thief here at my show, and I need to figure out who it is. Or maybe the, th <laughs> maybe the thief is on your end. Maybe Cousin Vinny got a hold of those cigars. Yeah, intercepted before they even arrived. All right. <laughs> In either way, we've got some problems that we have to sort yeah. out. But it's great to see it's you. To see you the too. show is called Single Drunk Female. You can watch it Thursday nights, 1030 on Freeform, and on Hulu the next day if you're too busy on Thursdays. Sophia Black D'Elia, everybody. We'll be back with school. Hi, I'm Jimmy Kimmel, and this is the internet. I made it myself. Hit subscribe if you like it.